There has been a flurry of activity in the gold sector over the past year, with consolidation amongst a number of key players in Western Australia, bringing heightened interest to the market. Combined with a recovery in the gold price, which now hovers around US $2,000 per ounce, investors are eager to understand what is next and how further consolidation may benefit them. The latest interest rate rise further fuels this thematic as investors look towards safe haven assets. In the Murchison Gold District, a number of explorers with high grade deposits appear ripe for M&A activity. This area has long been regarded as one of Australia's leading gold mining districts. Five key players in this area who may benefit from the opportunity for consolidation are Odyssey Gold, Great Boulder Resources, Aura Gold, Monument Mining and Mika Metals. All five projects have solid cash balances and a combined resource of 2.8 million ounces at 2.8 grams per tonne. In August, Odyssey announced its maiden resource estimate for the Takanara Gold project, totaling 5.32 million tonnes at 2.2 grams per tonne of gold for 376,000 ounces. And earlier this month, Odyssey announced high grade results from their more recent diamond drilling campaign into two holes, with both holes successfully intersecting the highway zone structure. Importantly, the results are 80 metres below Odyssey's existing shallow mineral resource. Meanwhile, Aura Gold has also reported exceptional grades from its near-surface Crown Prince prospect, while Great Boulder has been proving up their flagship Sidewell Gold project. And Mika Metals completed a scoping study to demonstrate the merits of commencing mining of their open pit and underground resources. This sets the stage for the possible consolidation of these key players, which all have outstanding exploration potential. You only have to look at West Gold, who, after being outbidded for Musgrave Minerals by Romilius Resources a couple of months ago, has beefed up its coffers with a new $100 million revolving corporate facility, reportedly focused on strengthening its M&A plans. So you can see this spells out the significant opportunity for investors with more takeovers looming on the horizon. With an $18 million market cap, Odyssey Gold stands out as the company with the most value. And given Managing Director Matt Briggs has openly expressed an appetite for growing the company's resources in the Murchison, they're the one to watch in this space.